Ash and the soldier of the game split a 42 dug get into a little verbal altercation in Las Vegas at the casino. And anytime you love to gamble and you in spots like that, you got to travel in packs, you know, at least five deep. Because anytime you get into an altercation, they're going to be about four or five deep because they're going to travel in packs. So if you're an artist, you know, especially like 42 Doug at his level, you got to stay deep because you don't want to be world star, you know, because they're going to be super hype. You know, they're going to be super aggressive because you 42 Doug. And then you got the bystanders that's going to stand around. A lot of females, a lot of men with their phone out because they're trying to record because it's 42 Doug in the mix of it, right? But the scam is... If y'all pop it off or they pop it off and then a female get knocked out by security or your team or they team, they'll still blame it on you, 42 Doug. That's a scam where they'll sue you. Men get hit because it's going to be a big brawl, right? So if y'all hit, you know, a lot of suing going to come afterwards. And then what the police and the judge and the lawyers going to look at is who started it because everybody going to record it. So not including the casino cameras, but why would you need them when you got people up close with their footage and they can hear it better so they can hear what y'all saying better. So they're going to be listening for who started it, who keep engaging in it, who trying to back off. So to all artists, R&B singers, rappers, producers, anybody, A&Rs, you know, comedians, NBA players, sports players, NFL players, hockey, baseball, it don't matter how you coming, a model. If y'all in entourages, you know, you might want to not swing first. You see what I'm saying? Let the other people swing first, especially if they ain't got no guns or no knives involved. Yeah, you might not want to swing first because that's going to play a big factor in the courtroom when it's time to sue. Now, I know you got money. Ho, ho, I know you got money. I know you can pay all that duh. You can pay hundreds of thousands, but why? You know what I'm saying? Why? Because in a time like this where it's still a lot of strict rules and the new COVID might be coming out or we might get back on lockdown, ain't no need to be paying 100, 200, 300, 400, 500,000 in the courtroom. Not only to the casino, if y'all damage anything enough, if y'all damage one of their games or the other side damage one of their games, they might blame it on you if you started it. You see what I'm saying? So to avoid situations like that, you know, it's cool to have a verbal match and all that duh because you still want to stand up for yourself with the verbal thing because you got everybody recording. So that's what everybody looking for. How for the two duh acting? Is he acting like them records? How he come on the records? Do he got that same type of energy? But you did, right? You hold your own. So, of course, they're going to get extra loud and try to intimidate you with their voice and their manpower, especially when they're bigger than you. You know, you're a shorter guy, so nine times out of ten, the opponent going to be bigger than you or taller than you, right? So, they're going to try that first. They're going to try to intimidate you with the manpower, with the loudness. If they see that it don't work, which it didn't, you stood your team, you stood your ground, you know, that's when it'll continue to be a verbal match until somebody swing you know or until security or police get involved so really at a casino not when y'all just gambling playing domino i'm talking about at a casino you kind of want day security around you you know what i'm saying instead of your no keep your entourage i ain't saying that like keep your entourage but you kind of want day security around so they can go ahead and intervene at the beginning you know what i'm saying because if they weren't there you know y'all probably a hit because they ain't backing down they from dc or somewhere they claiming so you already know how dc coming or if they was from the D, I couldn't really hear, but they say D.C., you know how they coming. They ain't going to back down. They never have, right? Y'all ain't going to back down. Y'all from Detroit, so y'all know y'all ain't going to back down. Y'all never have, right? So you're going to need, you know, their security, their police, whatever, to get in between y'all so it can put something on their mind. You know what I'm saying? Because y'all the bad. They not. You know what I'm saying? You beat them, you brainless. They beat you, they famous. So you got to, you know, put that Jay-Z quote in your head. When you're in situations like that, you know, in the streets, you can go left or right. It ain't too many cameras. It ain't a lot of, you know, taxpaying citizens there. So all these people there that's recording, they're saying, go for this, you dub. That's for this, you dub. They're going to sue you. Yeah, they're going to stand right there. They're going to try to get close as they can. And they hope they get punched. They hope they get hit by a chair. They hope they even fall over a chair, get tripped by a machine or anything. They're going to blame it on you. They're going to say it was the cause of you. Yoke entourage. They're going to say you started it and all that there. You see what I'm saying? So... You got to be careful of that. It's a lot of scams when it comes to that. But you did good. You handled yourself like I knew you would. You know what I'm saying? You don't back down. You don't seem like the type to will. Even if you was to lose a fight, they don't mean nothing. The best of us lost a fight. They don't mean anyone took nothing from you. Even though the fans would have roast you and all that stuff. But they don't mean nothing. You still still 10. You still hold your ground. You know what I'm saying? You know, you're a gangster. So, you know, when you're a gangster, when you're in bars and you in casinos and you like to gamble situations like this gonna keep happening or it's gonna happen every blue moon you see what i'm saying so it's a must that you stay four or five deep when you're in spots like that it's a must
You know what I'm saying? For your safety, for your brain, for your bank account, for your lawyer. Ain't no use to spending no unnecessary money. You see what I'm saying? But that's my take on this conversation right here, man. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell, man. Go.